Hello, and welcome to my channel. My name's John Coffey, and I am the Unpaved Explorer. Today is Thursday, June 4th, 2020. Today, I am doing an unboxing of the Walmart Ozark Trails cast iron Dutch oven. Now, I've been looking to get a Dutch oven for a while now, but the ones that I really like and would like to have are pretty expensive. They range anywhere between 60 and $100. Came across this one at Walmart. I I watched a few videos out of it and I decided to make the purchase just, just to see how good or how bad it really is. And uh, one thing good about this one was the price tag. I picked up this Dutch oven for $17.42 plus tax. So let's get to the unboxing. This is the Ozark Trails 5 quart cast iron Dutch oven. You could get this at Walmart. The price tag of this when I got it was $17.42 plus tax. It comes with two pieces, the lid and the Dutch oven. So this comes in a box. This is the Ozark Trails 5 quart cast iron Dutch oven. So This is the lid. Looks like we got a little bit of rust. The handle is actually screwed onto the lid, the handle. So it looks like the stand or the feet of the Dutch oven was not actually part of the casting. It looks like it's connected to the Dutch oven with a weld. got the spring handle on the bale. You may or may not like that feature uh, depending on how you use your Dutch oven whether you hang it or not.
the inside of the Dutch oven is actually rough. So, uh, I'm not going to smooth it out. Uh, it will uh, smooth out over time. And uh, it's pre-seasoned. But I'll go ahead and rinse it off and season it. I do have a seasoning video on how to season your cast iron skillets. You do the same thing for your Dutch oven. So, my first impressions of the Ozark Trails Dutch oven. I actually like the spring bale. I probably wouldn't hang this that often, so I'm okay with the spring handled. The lid does not fit tightly on this Dutch oven as you can tell it slides around a lot I don't like the fact that the handle is screwed into the lid and I don't like the fact that the stand or the feet of the Dutch oven it was not part of the original casting, but is welded on there. Also, what I don't like is how rough and how coarse the inside of the Dutch oven is. But for $17.42 plus tax, it's a Dutch oven, five quarts, under 20 bucks. We'll see how, how it works over time. So, I'm going to go ahead and give this quick rinsing off with some water. Oil it up. Get it in the oven, preheat your oven at 300 degrees, and let it sit in the oven upside down for one, two hours. Get it seasoned up really well. The first couple of meals you make in your Dutch oven should contain a lot of fat to help season the uh, Dutch oven. Not sure what my first couple of meals will be. It'll probably include probably some bacon, maybe some short ribs. We'll see. So that was my first impressions. Well, I hope you liked the video of the unboxing and first impressions of the Walmart Ozark Trails cast iron Dutch oven. Please like, share, and subscribe. If you have any questions, any comments, please place the questions and comments in the comment screen. As always, all comments are welcome. Again, my name is John Coffey, and I am the Unpaved Explorer, 
And I'm out of here. You take care and keep exploring the outdoors. And let me know if you have a Dutch oven, what brand do you have? I look forward to hearing your comments.